DedSec's gonna do more than just this. the gist. Malice Intelligence checks out. A rogue faction of SRS officers framed DedSec for the bombings to consolidate power over the government. But now they've noticed that some people are standing up to the new order and they're blaming you. I believe these are the people you call Zero Day. I don't know their names, but it's safe to assume they have a ringleader. And in my experience overseas, removing the leader... That's Counterinsurgency 101, fam. I want to know, why now? Two weeks ago, a shell company connected with Zero Day's operations imported 40 kilos of Semtex from an old Soviet bloc depot. But it never left London. Which means Zero Day is planning a bombing that will make those earlier bombings look like a bonfire. And I think I know why. As we're all now painfully aware, false flag attacks are a common propaganda tool for despots. Kill a load of people and the rest fall into line behind whoever says they won't let it happen again. In this case, Zero Day. Which means we both want to discover who's pulling Zero Day strings and stop them. We need to get hold of the personnel dossiers of anyone connected with the earlier bombings and their cover-up. Then Malak and I can analyze their common connections and work out who's in charge of Zero Day. And I'll be on the con to observe. So if Malik's right, Zero Day are some kind of shadowy cabal of spies who blew up half the city to secretly take control of the government. But now they're pissed off that someone's standing up to them, so they're going to do it again. That's awful. I agree. You'd think they'd come up with something besides another bombing. Bit of a double beat, isn't it? Do you think Zero Day's doing this because of us? Because we stood up? Cut that victim-blaming shit. I'd rather get blown up a thousand times than lie down just so some wannabe tyrants can stamp on my face. We need more badass folks like you on our team. Glad to have you. Brilliant. Finally found my people. <laughs> Glad to hear it. I'm here. You're stealing Sir's personnel dossiers. The organization is strictly compartmentalized, so they aren't stored in one central location. Spying on spies. What could go wrong? SIRS uses a supercomputer called Filament to process information drawn from the CTOS network. It's like Noodle, if you could use it to search every document on every civilian, government or commercial device everywhere in the United Kingdom. Instantly. Jesus. You could be horrified if you want, but it saved thousands of lives. Get access to a Filament terminal and I'll provide you with the search terms.
Deploying drones to apprehend the suspects. So this is filament. Impressive. I can help you break in, but we're going to leave a trail. Unless, of course, Malik has an idea. There. I persuaded Filament Security to log that Spiderbot's activity as system maintenance. Thanks. But if I was a wiser man, I'd be wary of a helpful spy. It's not like the movies. Spies aren't the police. I believe in working with the lesser evils like DedSec to protect society from the greater ones. So why did Zero Day kill all my friends? There are differing schools of thought. Got the zero day dossiers. Now, if no one objects, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Bloody brilliant. I've got those dossiers. What now? Right, so we do a simple CTOS contact analysis and work out who's in charge of Zero Day. I'll have it done before you can say Guantanamo. I'll handle the classified data, thank you very much. It would be so much faster if I worked with you in order to do this. The people in these dossiers are connected, but not necessarily complicit. It will take intelligence expertise to separate the wheat from the chaff. And when I discover something actionable, I will contact you. He's disconnected. Pleasant fella. I have Malik for you. All right. Put him on. We have to meet. There's been a complication. I can't access the files you stole. Hang on. What? 
The files are locked, and a moment after we got them, I received this. Hello, Richard. We see you're trying to find us by looking into our associates. That's a good idea. Hope you don't mind if we borrow it. Who was your masked savior, we wonder? I've sent Bagley the coordinates for a meeting. I hope I don't need to explain why this is a priority. Feeling ready to fight? Let's do it. Your hench, mate. I think you got what it takes to save London. Are you with... Deadsick? How do I know you haven't been sent by one of those reptoids holding office in this country? What? The politicians, mate. They're all reptile people, bent on destroying us. You must have seen them. They have those weird forked tongues, don't they? Um... I know who they are. Some of them are hiding in plain sight, but I sorted out who they are. I do something about these reptile people, and then I'll know you're safe. I'll see what I can do. No, don't get up. I need a high-ranking SIRS officer's biometrics, eyes and fingers. The fuck? We don't have time to piss about. Keep your voice down. The data was encrypted. So what? Bagley can crack that shit? Not faster than I could, and I've tried. It's hopeless in the time we have. Look, if you don't help me, zero day wins. Which means we all die. Fucking fuck. So, hack some fuckers' fingers off? No. High-res photos will do. The problem is it has to be the acting Home Office liaison. And sirs will burn their credentials if they're attacked. It's protocol. So you'll have to get them the old-fashioned way. Oh, so torture? Christ, no. Develop a relationship. Get someone close and uh, take the photos covertly. All right, cool. Sounds fun. This part of the craft can be ugly. Send someone who can handle it. Bags, little help, yeah? I suggest you begin your relationship with the SIRS Home Office liaison the way you would with anyone, by meticulously poring over every detail of their life and hunting them down. Keep talking. The SIRS Home Office liaison is the bridge between the government and its intelligence service. Their office at Downing Street would be a good place to start your relationship. Got us a plan. Let's go, yeah? The SIRS Home Office liaison works here, but I'm not seeing them on any unsecured surveillance. Ah, but their assistants here. Start by hacking them. Got it. Keep it up. Seriously. Right. Right. 
Keep a low profile here. Yeah? Low profile here. Yeah? Just you and me now. My mind to yours. Keep it score. Download complete. Now Scarper or they'll kill you for sure. Got it. 16 email threads indicate the Home Office liaison is a right lush. She spends most of her time down at the Three Hawker Boys. If you want to seduce, sorry, start a relationship with her, that's as good a place as any. Give me the location. Done. I don't got time for outmoded mating rituals. You wanna fuck my shit up or what? Ooh, if that's how you treat a one-liner, I shudder to think of what you do with two. Goodbye. No reason to be shitty. Rough day or something. Oh, I'm in a great mood, actually. It's just that I'm wasting my scant leisure time fending off the advances of a haggard swamp creature. Fuck you. Not even in your wildest dreams, sweetie. I'm still learning the nuances of human interaction, but my analysis indicates that you aren't her type. Oh, yes. Thanks for that brilliance, Bags. Quit your whining. There's plenty of fish in the sea, and we've got the biggest saltwater aquarium in town. At least one of our fish is bound to be fuckable. Go on, then. Just try someone else. Maybe a man this time.
Dead set calling. Are you up for some freedom fighting? Every little bit helps, doesn't it? question. Did we get matched on invite? If we didn't, I'm going to have their CEO killed. Maybe don't. I was just kidding. Ah, uh, careful who you fib to. Someone almost died. Now, nah, that would be awkward. I should say. Shall we move this conversation somewhere a bit more... private? Oh, my! Didn't know you could do that. <laughs> What other secrets are you hiding? Wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> so after all that, did you acquire the biometric data? Confirmed. Eye and finger scans are secure. And on a personal note, that was... Nice. Might have needed that. Brilliant. Now what? It seems you'll have to maintain the ruse a bit longer. The upload is still going and I have an incoming connection from the liaison. Patch her through. Enough crap. Who the hell are you? You working for the Russians? China? Fucking America? If I was a spy, would I have answered? Just calm down. Let's talk about this. Oh, do shut up. Upload complete. Malik is on the line. I'm sure he'll be very grateful and polite. This will have to do. We can meet at Westminster Abbey to discuss the results. And I wanted to say... You performed somewhat better than anticipated. Wow. What a compliment. He's disconnected. Seriously? Well, I did it. I actually did it. You wouldn't have been recruited if DedSec thought you'd be killed that easily. I see. I suppose that's a compliment. The bagsman is like that. Bit of a prick, but dead useful. Just ignore him if he's vexing you. I've marked the meeting location on your map. Don't hurry. Thank you, sir. You've arrived at Westminster Abbey, final resting place of noted cousin fucker King Edward I. Is that relevant, Bagley? It is if you're his cousin. Anyway, have a seat. I'll notify Malik you've arrived. to walk away. I haven't slept in 76 hours. I, I can't do this. You're just tired. No, I'm afraid. I know who runs Zero Day and I don't think I can beat her. Don't give a fuck. Just need a name. <sighs> Not asking. All right. I'm trusting you with this. My analysis indicates that Zero Day is led by the current director of SIRS Counterterrorism, Emma Child. 
Legend has it she's the reason that Gorbachev survived the coup in 91, but more than that, she's my friend. She mentored me through my first field assignment years ago. Well, six tempered Tyrannus, eh? Wait, wait. There's always a margin of error. If you go after Emma and I'm wrong, you'll have her and Zero Day to contend with. Confirm it's her before you do anything. We'll be careful. Be right. Or we'll both be dead. I hate to agree with a career snoop, but Malik's right. We need to tread carefully here. This is the head of size fucking counterterrorism we're moving against. We haven't decided to make that move yet. Emma Child's just a lead for now. Okay. I can live with that. So how do we find her? Bagley, have a gander at those SIRS dossiers. If you can figure out who works directly under Child and hack their comms, we're in. Done. Oh, aren't you clever? But we can't just wait around for them to slip up and blab Emma Child's location. We have to make them slip up and call a meeting with her. So we do something big, something old school dead sec. Really scare the shit out of them. Emma Child is the head of SRS Counter-Terror, which coordinates operations with Albion out of the old MI6 building. So, if we were to break in and leave a message that we know will get back to her... Nice. Let's do that. That is the old MI6 building, one of the most prominent intelligence organisations in the world. But now, thanks to SIRS taking over, the dark heart of every secret scheme and bloody coup in the whole of Europe. So, no huge difference, really. All right. What's a few new scares anyway? Bagley, don't scare him. You just have to find the central server room and connect us. We'll do the rest. You've got this.
this'll be a fucking brawl. the case file server there. Connect badly and we'll take care of it. Grand. Quick mission update. But you have to promise not to be mad. Bagley, don't fuck a bell. Just say it. Well, since you didn't promise, I can't give you the details. But suffice to say, there's an absolute piss monsoon of Albion goons heading your way. Done. Holy shit. I'm just glad we're on the same side. Well done. Now haul your arse elsewhere, yeah? We'll be in touch when we have something. from Emma Chart's organization than a nest of randy wasps. Fuck, that was fast. Well, I may have sent everyone in Chart's inner circle security footage of your little MI6 operation, just to speed things up a bit. Is that safe? No, not really, but then you're a violent insurgent who runs around in a colorful mask punching mercenaries, stealing top secret intelligence and driving through street cafes. Define safe. Fair point. So, what's the play? A small group is meeting with Emma Child in a parking garage. They've switched off the CCTV cameras, but if you connect me to the building's CTOS hub, I can switch them back on, because I'm very clever. That's the move, then. 